Hello everyone, this is Imabong Smart and today is our very first episode on our podcast chat about purpose. Anyone who knows me knows that I am your purpose strategist and I talk about everything that has to do with purpose. Talk about relationships, talk about business, talk about family, anything at all that has a purpose, I'm going to be talking about it. So the thing about purpose is, purpose is given, Right? And I think this is the hardest part for most people generally, um, especially most people who do not want to connect or be associated with God. But the truth of the matter is, you know, if you look at your house, if you look at your, if you look at anything that you have, you know that everything around you has a purpose, right? Even if the purpose is not big, you know that everything around you has a purpose. And I promise you that the thing that you have around you did not generate its own purpose. It was created by someone for a reason. And so are you. Now, when it comes to purpose discovery, you need to be able to connect to your creator. You are beautifully made, perfectly designed. Every curve and every edge of you is so intentional. When God was creating you, creating you, he had an agenda in mind. He had a purpose in mind. So most people tend to want to discover purpose outside of God. That's like the rain trying to fall without the cloud. They don't need the cloud, but they still want it to rain. That is not scientifically possible. When you look at yourself, you know, I don't care what they say, but whatever evolution is, evolution is not science because Evolution makes you believe that the scientific impossibility that something came out of nothing, that is scientifically impossible, right? And so based on that, I know that you are not from evolution. You are so intellectually uh, uh, created. So the first thing for you to do before you can even discover your true purpose is to connect with God. That's as simple as it is. Connect with God. He is the purpose giver. But purpose discovery is not easy. Your purpose is so valuable. I love to say this. It is the, according to the Bible, it is the, the glory of, a, of God to hide the matter. But it is the honor of kings to search it out. I guarantee you that you cannot walk out of your door right now and go pick up a two carat diamond just lying around randomly. Anything that has value is hidden away from the sight of everybody so that only those who are hungry enough, only those who desire and who work hard can get it. Diamonds are not on the surface. The beautiful gems that people kill and die for are not on the surface. They are hidden in the deep of the earth. Your purpose is so valuable. But the thing about purpose is you have to be patient with yourself. You have to patiently take the time to look into yourself, to dig deep into your soul, into your heart, and find out genuinely what that thing is in you, what that purpose is that God has hidden on the inside of you. So it's going to take you getting off your lazy uh, couch, getting out of your comfy couch and throwing out that comfortable blanket and getting to work. Forget about all the things that you spend time, wasting time on social media. This is not a waste of time because of social media and it's trying to help you discover who you are. So this kind of stuff is what you need to be watching. This is not a waste of time, but you need to spend time, get away from all the distractions. Because if you're going to find something valuable, you're going to have to shut the doors and windows and put things away that could easily take your attention from what you're trying to do, right? So take yourself away from all the distractions or take the distractions away and find the time to look deep into yourself. And that's the journey of purpose discovery. So that's all I have for you on this episode today. If you love this episode, please like and comment and share with your friends and family, because guess what? When someone is working in divine purpose, it reduces crime and it reduces all these crazy things we see happening because if people are busy working on their God-given purpose, it's going to be less time for people to be messing around. So if you care about your neighbor, if you care at all about this world, share this video, like, subscribe, follow, and I will see you next week for another episode on Chat About Purpose. God bless you and have a lovely day.